Alright. What's up guys? It's Logan. So I'm here with another video today. Today's video is gonna be chest workouts. So we're gonna start out with a couple of cardio workouts. I'm just gonna be showing you guys the run. Just like I showed in the last week's video, just running to get a little sweat worked up first. Then we're gonna move into uh, my favorite three workouts for uh, your chest, my favorite three chest workouts. Then we're gonna finish up with abs. Uh, me personally, I feel like if you have a big chest, no matter how big your chest is or how defined your chest is, if you have a big belly or you have a fat stomach, you know what I mean? You're not gonna really be able to tell that you have a nice chest. So we're gonna obviously finish out with abs. And so yeah, if you guys are interested in seeing my favorite chest workouts, continue watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. All right, guys, so let me start by saying it was 96 degrees outside today. Uh, I didn't mention earlier, but it was 96 degrees. I always tell you guys this, that I like to work out when it's really hot outside because it's easier to work up a sweat when it's really hot. Uh, you don't really have to do much. You still are burning calories and just, you know, getting all of those bad toxins out of your body. We like to start out with cardio all the time because it's just it good, it's good to get all of the toxins out of your body. So it helps with your skin. It helps with your weight loss. It helps with just pretty much just about everything. Uh, you'll just feel great after doing this, you know, 15 minute job. So that's what I'm doing first. Alright guys, so now we're going to be moving into push-ups. Uh, the best, most effective workout for chest that I know of is definitely going to be push-ups. Unless you want to be in the gym doing bench press and stuff like that. Uh, the best home workout for chest, in my opinion, is definitely push-ups hands down. Uh, so what I like to do is just make mine a little bit different and put my feet up on anything around the house. You can put it up on your bed frame. You can put it up on your stairs. You can put it up on literally anything just to elevate yourself and add a little bit more resistance. That's what we talked about in the last video. Uh, adding resistance always helps. Uh, and then also what I like to do, as you guys can see here, is change my hand position. So I always like to start out with a regular, you know, whatever is comfortable, just get down and start your push ups. Do a good set of uh, 10, one set of 10, and then move your hands to B, which is actually what I'm doing right now. So this is all just regular push ups, regular just got down, put my hands in my regular position. From here, I'm going to move into wide, and you guys will see in just a second right there how I just kind of spread my hands a little bit more wide, and that's just going to give you a little bit more definition on the outsides of your chest. Uh, then from there, you're going to move in onto the inside and do triangle push ups, which is what I'm doing right here. That's going to give you a little bit more definition on the inside of your chest. So, what I like to do is just do about 10 sets, I mean, 10 numbers of three sets or four sets. So, that's like at least 90 push ups a day. Uh, and that to me is my favorite, favorite, favorite chest workouts. All right, guys, so now we're going to move into abs. As I said in the beginning, I feel like abs are one of the most influential parts of having a good chest. So what I'm doing right here is basically just sitting back up against the wall. You're going to sit back up against the wall, spread your legs, and then lean forward. So right now, my back is not touching the wall as much as it seems like I am. That's just for, um, you know, to get started, you're going to lean back up against the wall, but always sit up off of the wall and then just proceed to like pull yourself forward. This is going to be a good ab workout. Uh, it's going to kind of feel uncomfortable at the beginning, but just make sure you feel any strain that you do feel, make sure the strain should be in your abs. If it's not in your abs, then you're not doing it right. So yeah, here I am again, sit up against the wall, sit back, and then make sure you sit forward, boom, and then start to pull. So yeah. That's pretty much the ab workout that we're adding in today. Also, you could do any of the ab workouts that we I've shown you guys throughout the uh, weeks, but this is one of my favorite. You just sit up against the wall, sit forward to where your back isn't touching, and then proceed to pull. All right, guys, so for the second um, ab workout that we're gonna be doing today, like the first, it has a lot to do with posture. So basically, all I'm doing is just laying down, you know, on the ground and then sitting myself up. That should be pretty easy for everyone. You just lay yourself down on the ground, sit back up without having to put your hands under your butt, without having to put your hands under uh, behind your head or anything like that. Just sit straight up. However, the thing that should make this harder is that once you sit up, you're going to take a deep breath in and out. Um, so basically just inhale once you sit up. You can't really tell in my video that I'm taking a moment to do that every time I sit up because I kind of sped my video up just a little bit. But uh the the most important thing that you should do in this in these ab workouts is have great posture sit all the way up back straight and then make sure you take a deep breath once you sit up and that you should be able to feel it in your abs uh after you do it i did this maybe what i try to do my abs i do i just do abs until i really can't anymore so just try to do it as many times as possible you know add probably three sets probably what three sets of 20 i don't know uh but you know just do it until you feel the burn <laughs> 
and then obviously this is the same workout that we did last week so if you guys want to incorporate this as well you can do this too just pull your legs all the way out pull them all the way in and then you know that's that so hope you guys enjoyed this week's chest workouts um i will see you guys in my next video peace Thank you.